the worst topic of all, Freemasonry. Because at the opening ceremony of the 2019 Military World Games in Wuhan, China, they brought out all of these soldiers, and they're not Chinese soldiers. They have United Nations helmets on. Each one, of course, is carrying a gun because nothing says peace quite like bringing out thousands of people all equipped with automatic assault rifles in full military garb and war helmet on. And once again, notice these are UN soldiers. They're not soldiers of the Chinese military. They're soldiers of the one world government of the United Nations. So, of course, they're going to show the United Nations logos and spinning. You see the trees in the middle, kind of like the lands in here. And I don't know if this is Antarctica or what, but what a display to the United Nations right here. But let's see just what these soldiers of the One World Government who serves Lucifer, the United Nations, let's see what they want to display in their symbolism. Here we get a square. Is that like a square and compass? I'm not sure, but this, oh, yes, that's definitely a uh, Masonic apron surrounded by United Nations symbols. You can see the one-to-one -one correlation between this image right here and this image right here. So a nice display here that the uh, United Nations are showing who they belong to and who their allegiance is to. And I wonder what they called this. Oh, here it is. It's called a new world. <laughs> no surprise there. And watch this. This is pretty interesting. You've got the moon with the Chinese rover on it. Uh, but you got this group of kids over here. And they're in, they're in outer space. And there's a guy leading them along. He has a torch. He's carrying the torch here. He's leading them through outer space. And while they're going through outer space, it also shows an astronaut flying through outer space, and he's also carrying the torch. So it's like the uh, the guy who's leading the kids through outer space is synonymous with the astronaut who's who's going through space. And once they've, uh, if I guess, finished traveling through space, they find themselves at this new world or this new land. And what do we have here? Looks like this new world or this earth is surrounded by some kind of a some kind of a ring. I don't know where I've seen something like this before. So I guess it's not a real big deal when, you know, countries like this display their military power and how strong they are. Nothing says peace quite like Miles and miles of uh, military equipment and military personnel and hundreds of drones and rocket launchers. And of course, no military is complete without a regiment of perfect robots who do not have minds of their own, but only operate under the one great intelligence of their military commanders. Great parade, China. I just wasn't sure if these guys were the Chinese military or if they were part of the United Nations military. Or if, in fact, there isn't really a difference between the two. And an excellent show here that citizens aren't allowed to even take a single step without the government orchestrating that. No individual movements in your steps. You must all move in a complete robotic hive mind here, directed by your Masonic masters. Congratulations, China. Big round of applause. You guys are almost as cool as the United States of Israel.